What's up, everybody? We're back with another one of my favorite cars here at LS Fest, LS Fest with Lexstein. Lex, this car's got me tongue-tied because if there's one thing that I like more than wagons, it's crew cab horsepower, four doors, more fun. This G8's pretty gnarly. And I guess to kick things off here, you know, what got you into cars and racing? Yeah. Um, hey guys, I'm Lex. I'm from South Dakota. Um, my husband, Jordan, actually got me into racing. We've been together for about 12 years. Before I met him, I had no interest in cars. He daily drove an 86 Monte Carlo SS and he started the bad habit. So, so he drug you into this and you became a willing participant. Yes, he created a monster. And kind of going off of that, this car is a monster. It caught my eye in the line of tech. One of my favorite cars, like I said, I love four doors. It hurts even worse when that second set of doors passes you. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> Tell us what this is. Yeah, uh, this is my 2009 Pontiac G8 GT. I've had it for seven years. When I bought it, it was completely stock. I ran an LSA supercharger on it for four years, I believe, on the stock bottom end. And I went like 936 at 147 with that before I lifted it head. And after that, we decided that we should probably build a motor and I wanted to go big or go home. So we did a Dart 427 that Thompson Motorsports built. And then we took it over to Coza Performance in Elgin, Illinois, and they did a custom twin turbo kit. It's got, oh, excuse me. Um, it's got comp oiless turbos. They're 7275s. We also did a TH400 and I am still IRS. I actually have the fastest IRS G8 right now, and I've got the ZL1 cradle out of that. Um, yeah. uh, oh. We just went to air to water intercooler on it. It was air to air last year. So this is kind of the first time we're really testing it out. I've tried a couple times this year, but the track did not want to allow that. So hopefully we, should, we can get some clean passes this event. And this car, like I said, it's just cool because it's so incredibly, like, to say it's clean is an understatement. Like, the old pictures don't do it justice line fits this car well. What's people's typical reaction, you know, to the car, let alone a female wheeling this beast and just laying the smack down? They usually have no idea what it's capable of. You can't see the turbo, so I like to joke around and tell people that it's cam only. Oh, I thought it was a pro-charge car. <laughs> Legit, I thought I was like, oh, it's a pro-charger, twin turbo. I'm no, like, they're hidden pretty well. Um, but then they'll see me crack off a couple eights and they're like, oh my gosh. So yeah, yeah it's pretty cool. It makes like north or just south of 1500 to the wheels, um, like 22 pounds of boost. And I've been 822 at 171 miles an hour so far. And I'm hoping to get into the sevens this year. It's just a seven second street car, right? Yeah, family sedan, Yeah. grocery getter. I take it to Starbucks all the time. Yeah, yeah, I mean, you just, you know, drag people around at the track and then, you know, go get your coffee and call it a day, right? Yep, exactly. What is your favorite part about driving this car? <sighs> it's just, it's my baby. I've had this car for seven years. I love this thing to death. Like, it's literally like a child to me, so I just enjoy driving it. It's not as smooth as it used to be, but it's, it's a lot of fun and I just really enjoy it. What is going to be your reaction when you light the boards with a seven for the first time? I will probably cry. <laughs> not going to lie. Like Happy cry, was, right? Not ugly cry. cry. Happy tears. Um, last year, I actually ran my first eight second pass right here. Um, I thought I was just going to get like an 890, but no, I went like 855. <laughs> so, that was pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, so hopefully maybe something like that will happen. But right now I just want to make a clean 80 meter pass and hopefully it goes well and the rain stays away. I'll tell you what though, like I said, this is one of my favorite cars. It caught my attention because it is so clean. You guys have built one bad ride. Enjoy it this weekend. I appreciate it. Thank you.